So I let Astarion suck my blood last night. I've already apologized. I need to know how we're gonna feed you later on. You know what I am now. I can fight with all my weapons. Teeth included. Okay, buddy. That's enough from you. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too? Unbelievable! One fight just ended, guys. You're picking another one? Relax. Tell that to the dead at the gate. Shut their horns! You see the tiefling's jaw clench. He's about to erupt. I'm just gonna stand back. With a thunk, the armored man collapses. We need to pack up and leave. Immediately! Thank you for your help out there. I'm Zevlor. Hello, Zevlor. I'm Yusuke. Well met. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. I just need to find the healer. Goblin got you. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense. We must explore the town. See what everyone's about. Uh, let me sell you the bits and bobs that I carry. Got all the bits and bobs you need. There we go. Take all your money, boy. Sell you all these useless knives. Yes, yes. Take it all. Take this fork as well. Hells, we can't just leave. They're kin. Have you forgotten El Turel? We should stand by our people. No one else will. This isn't El Turel. Do any of you speak to animals? No, no one can talk to animals. That's unfortunate. I'll use my arcane knowledge to speak to this cow. Hey, I'm so smart. Oh, oh bloodless. Oh man, this is not good. I'm not gonna feed a Starion again. Something's off. This creature isn't what it appears to be. Okay, we passed it. Come on, man. Just use my magic on you. Donnie, what are you doing, Donnie? He stares right past you, as if you're invisible. Or boring. You see nothing out of the ordinary. As you turn back, the child slips between the rocks. Oh, sneaky boy. You find the edges of a concealed entrance. The edges of a concealed entrance. Yes, I see it. I see it myself. Okay, let's speak to the rest of the townsfolk before we do anything crazy. Go on. Give me a best shot. He's just humiliating this child. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. Need you to be better. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. Come on. I believe in you. That's good advice, child. You'll do well to listen. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your The man oh. bends down. Oh no. And his thoughts become yours. You are the blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe hell. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on no, the you are on the ship. Let me peer further into your mind. You see the fiend again and ignite with Will's rancor. She is an infernal war devil, a threat to the living, evil incarnate. Shit. Shit! You saw her. Her name is Carla, an archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. Well, I'm more concerned about the parasite than this devil woman of yours. Shouldn't we look for a healer? Yes, buddy, you should go to my camp and wait there like a good boy. A splendid plan. We'll talk more there. A few words for the kids. Spare a story or two. Children, you should be strong and watch over your kin. That's what fighting is good for. Thanks. Next time the goblins come, I'll be ready. Boy, you look tiny. You should go hide under your mama's skirt. We've known enough grief this ten day traveler. Don't be the cause of more. I can't promise that, guard Ikaron. You know, I see a open crate. I just take the cheese from it. If I see an opportunity present itself, this whole town might burn. 
Crazy. There's no way of sugarcoating it, right? If you know, you know. What does the stone door lead to? A rope? Don't mind if I do. Best keep your hands to yourself. Oh, oh, I didn't mean to steal anything. I'm sorry. Why are you hiding down here, Zavalor? It's quite cowardly. You're the one who helped at the gate. Yeah, well, why are you giving me attitude if I'm just trying to steal some stuff? Huh? I have not spoken to Koga yet. I'm not your messenger. I want to discuss something else. What is what is it? That's Don't none of your business. Don't tell me what to do. Let's check out this little concealed hatch. Huh, it's a tiefling hideout. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. Not sure why you're poking your nose in our business, though. I don't know what your business is. None of yours. This is our hideout. But hey, maybe you didn't know. Because of that, I'll give you a 10 count to leave. Boy, you don't want to mess with me. You must be joking. Nine. Seven, <laughs> six, five, four, three. Wait, let me save. Two, one. What are you gonna do, boy? Or just run away? Y'all just run away. Let my daughter go right now. She's a thief, hell spawn, and you will wait for Corga's judgment. Let me through, Radrashev, or I'll rip your damn throat out! Oh no. He's a bear. He's a cute bear. Oh, you adorable. An adorable bear. Let's talk to the bear. Come, Magwin. Give, him Give a me chance. a chance. You, step back. Go join the other tieflings. Tieflings, you racist. If it weren't for me, you'd be overrun by goblins by now. Those a moment, Giorno. Yes. What? Speak some what? reason into her. Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. Of course she does. Release her. She stole the idol of Sylvanas. She must pay the price. She's a child. Oh, there's a snake. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? Someone said you wanted to see me. Here I am. First, judgment must be passed. Fine, I will stop her from imprisoning this child. I will detect Korga's thoughts. Come on. Come on, we can rule this. We can roll it and pass it. Yes! <laughs> I will take control and prove my authority. You have proven your authority. Now prove your mercy. Fair words. Child. Take to the others word of my grace. Sivasif. Tila, to me. It hurts. Oh, Shadowheart. Thank you, Korga. Master Halsin. Halsin isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue. Let Tila pierce it. A jealous leader. There's no leader at all. That woman has more venom in her heart than a snake in its fangs. Right. But at least the child is safe. Well, I do believe it was quite monstrous. However, the child must learn from her mistakes. Calm, let's cut the kids some slack, shall we? You're wondering why I was in Yes. Painful. Let's just clear the air about that now. Does it hurt? Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Kaga seems dangerous, putting a snake up to a little girl like that. Well seen. Well spotted. We've let a snake replace our leader. You know, if you're trying to find Halsin, maybe I can find him for you. Would you? Would you? I would give anything to see Halsin return home. Don't worry about it. I'll find him. Sylvanas' blessing upon you. And my gratitude as well. No, wait. I want to ask you about I Yeti, to see both. Just because I agreed to help with Halsin doesn't mean I don't have needs as well. 
I suppose you've noticed I'm not terribly fond of wolves. Maybe if you can, don't make me face any more of them. At least, not alone. Oh, Shadowheart, you'll never have to be alone again. Everyone's got their own fears. And uh, wolves are okay to be afraid of. I'll try to avoid wolves in the future. Just for you. Thank you. I had a feeling you'd be I'm understanding. I'm so understanding. You have no idea. We must now speak to Koga. See what she has to say. I'd say it. You think I'm a monster? You're a monster. Absolutely. Only a monster would threaten a child. You see only villains and victims. A viper bears her fangs, defending her brood. I call her mother. You call her monster. Zevlor truly believes that his people will perish on the road. Why would I lead a group of refugees to fix your mess? I feel like the right thing to do is to speak to Zevlor anyway, in case he needs the assistance. You will do more than speak. Well, Kaga, you are heartless indeed. Uh, calm down, boy. Probably not good at this, but... Hey! I can handle you just fine. Shadowheart, watch me handle this wolf. Thorn's fur bristles. He wants to jump. Wants to Calm bite. down, a boy. A growl builds in his throat as his eyes track the movement of your tail. Down, boy. He snarls a warning, flattening his ears and lowering his body, ready to pounce. I said down. Let's see what else lies inside the chambers. Nettie, do you know anything about mind flares? Why are you asking? Why are you asking? Well, something crawled into my eye. I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. No. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Huh, I was hoping for a lesser grave cure. How'd you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. I was kidnapped and infected. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look. You've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all Whoa, dead. Netty. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. I don't have a cure. Only a way out. Yeah, I should find Halson. I was thinking that as well. I'm not going to feel any symptoms. That mural... Like Darkest hour, a concord made, twixt harp and wild against the shade. Harp and wild? You recall stories of an alliance between druids and the harpers, but the details are vague. Okay, let's leave now. Is someone singing? It's beautiful. The sirens. Such a pretty song. Listen. A sweet melody beckons you. It vibrates with magic. A harpy's charm. I mean, I'll just vibe to the music for now. Your chest fills with yearning. You want to get closer. You need to get closer. Oh, no. Just a few more steps, and you can lose yourself in that sweet soul. Oh no. No, little kid. Oh no. You killed him. They killed the child. This isn't right. Oh man, it's horrible. Party has been defeated. I have to load the game. Little boy, I will avenge you.